So what is up bosses, it's your boy Boss Fabwad and welcome back to Hello Neighbor. I have had a thought that I could potentially like crouch. Can I put the crowbar through no, never mind. I thought I could put the crowbar through there so then another character could actually have it, so now I'm hopefully right, hello, I'm switching characters. No I'm not, never mind, you can catch me then. I still need the key on you. I think Everything should be a bit better with him not being literally right next to me, like I just recalibrated everything, which is pretty much what I've done every episode. This is still a bit of a trial. Run, what the hell was that on the ground? Have you? Oh, no, I can't. Oh, right, um... Right then, yeah, like, other games do work better. This is hell or neighbor, like, no dig at Tiny Build or Steel Wall or anyone like that. Especially not Steel Wall. Like, Tiny Build are renowned to making like buggy games like the head on neighbor games on yep. like not buggy right like they're quite buggy with when they first release and this is a brand new game like this version is obviously completely different like all well, the controls are different and everything i don't know how different from the psvr2 i think it's this guy i can play as now right who would be able to wait who would be able to actually grab that crowbar the crowbar that i put outside who would actually be able to have that now? I feel like I'll have to... I'll really have to play as this person and get this freaking key from the neighbour. Like, that's definitely what needs to be done. That door, I guess, with the three locks is, like, the main thing. Who the hell? Someone's freaking burping me. This is not the... No, this is what? This is the character that goes there? Where do I go? Right, you go... You can go up there. But we have a... Oh, wait, is there something up here? Oh, here we go. Or is this just... What is this? I don't... Is there a point of being up here? I don't see a point of being up here unless it's to, like, hide from... No, it's not to hide from the neighbour because there's a hiding spot literally right there. Oh, where is that? I don't think I've been there before. Where is that? Yeah, that does not look familiar. I saw that while editing the last episode. While editing it, like, I saw I saw two things, actually. That was one of the things. I forget what the other thing is. I still need to work out, like, I don't know how much of this game... The problem is you never know how much or, like, what in Hello Neighbor is stuff you need to do versus stuff that you can do to get a coin. What the hell is that in there? That freaking animatronic thing. Jesus Christ, right then. I feel like, yeah, I'm just going to go one by one through the characters, see who can actually do anything. This is the other thing that I saw. Another freaking pipe here. What is it with me and not seeing pipes? So I can use this to actually get down to the ground. There we go. Now we're actually fully outside. I put the crowbar there, though, last time, right? So I don't know where the crowbar's gone, like, it, it's not there anymore. I can, actually, the first thing I should do, I kind of like stopping at the moment for some reason. I hold the button to go forward and that just randomly stops me. There should be, yeah, there's a coin just over here. There we go. Boom! Oh, yeah, we got the coin, awesome. What the hell can I do out here? Like, am I? Or what? Is that meant to happen? Like, I... I... Okay. Or what? Oh! Ah, oh, that's a way to go backwards. I was not aware. Can I get in here? Like, um, as this character, this character's the only character that can come outside, and we have a slingshot. If I can freaking grab, grab the... There we go. Uh, this hand, no. That hand, there we go. And there's... Oh, it's doing this again. There's things like this, but I need to shoot that? Maybe not, that wasn't actually on it, though. Okay, maybe not, yeah. Just like, the specific character that we can be outside with has a slingshot. How have I never done that before? Like, I don't think that was a patch since. Okay, I probably need a freaking shovel, knowing what this game series is. I can't do anything with that, right? Never mind. That's nothing. I can possibly... Can I jump on this and then I can... No, oh, okay, there's no collision for that. Or at least there is collision, but there's no... Like, there's an invisible wall on top of it. I can open these. I just need to, like, turn off a... Oh, there's actually just a ladder there. 
I just need to turn off like a was whatever it's called, like a generator or something? To actually be able to open it. Okay, can't interact with that door at all. That is a uninteractable door. This over here? Like, if it doesn't have a symbol and it doesn't have the thing like the circle around it, you'll see here it has a circle so I can interact with it. Just a hiding spot though, nothing actually in there. Hello? Right. Can I... Okay, never mind, it's so hard to actually grab it. Um, oh, wait, that actually does do something. What was that? Is that a coin? I, I just saw a circle thing. It was it was the incorrect colour, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Something happens there if I shoot this. Right, that's not my... Oh, it's over there, of course it is. Under my freaking armpit this time. Right, completely missed it. What way do you... That way. If I shoot this like a few times, shoot it like three times maybe? Three times or, or twice, twice is good as well. Yep, three times, there we go. Then whatever that does, hopefully it will be very obvious what it does when I go back there. There's also, what is that there on the tree? Oh, are they targets? Targets, okay. Can I shoot these as well? For the camera? What do they do to the camera? Oh, ah, this is a code that I need. 1987? Was that the bite of 87 in Hello Neighbor? Who knows? I'm also a very good shot. You can tell that I play a lot of virtual reality. Jesus Christ, I also didn't realize my hands were this freaking shaky as well. 1975? 25. 1925, let's go, the year I was born. Wonderful, we shouldn't be playing freaking VR, being 98 years old. That is a, yeah, that's a fuse. It goes, does it go over there? Yes, okay. Because when you pick up things, you see like an icon appears to say that's what that thing needs. I see, we need to, right, okay, yes. I need to place this here, go up, bring this down, which I initially thought was uh. to the hell? Ah? The hell was that sound? Bring this down to then bring the lever burp thing up. It seems like I need it on that. Am I? Thank you. No? There we go. No? What the hell is going on? There we go. There's nothing on there though, so I have no idea if it's actually still going down or not. I guess I'll do it until I can't anymore? Uh, oh, Jesus. Right. Not be doing that. Oh, I'm falling. Right, is that probably far down enough? I can do that, there we go. See, like, things don't click into place like, oh, that needs to be there, it's VR, like, everything's very... Like, in real life, if you put a drink down, it's not. you're not going to put the drink down and suddenly, oh, it teleports to somewhere that the drink's meant to be. You know, the drink gets put down exactly the, the exact place you put it down. So it gets confusing sometimes. How am I still being turned around? At least, like, I can tell the icon getting a bit more obvious, or, like, higher, if this is going up. Like, if there's nothing on it, I can't tell if it's actually going up or not. And I can probably I can probably grab it from there, right? Thank you, my hand. Right, Jesus. Where the hell does this go, then? I think that's probably gone that... wherever it is. I think this, actually, I... I'm just going to take a guess... Put it down there. There we go. This is also not up anymore. Is that where I destroyed that balloon, I wonder? And I think, yeah, I think some things are like I have to redo. I have to redo getting this crowbar and stuff as well. Alright, yes, he actually came in here at one point. If I grab that crowbar again, do I need to... No. Okay, maybe I don't need this crowbar because I've already had the door open. Like, maybe I'll just, yeah, like, I don't need this crowbar here, right? So I can just put that... No. Never mind. Oh, no. Oh, I see. It's just there. No. What? Oh, is that what it does? That, like, brings stuff up. Okay. Turn that off, and I thought it was, but then the valve thing, or whatever it's called, wasn't actually coming up. I think that's now pushing down, right? Yeah, that's now pushing down. So... 
I don't need this character anymore, I believe. There's something, I can like see something in there if I go in here. Oh wait, there's a key. Oh, he's... Yes, I see, because he's having a shower now, so I've got the key. Nice. I don't need it here though, so also put this down the chute. He can get to me, but now it's fine. Like, now it doesn't matter anymore. Yeah, now, now everything's down there. I can... There we go, switch to... Whoever. I know you're quite far down. You're like the bottom tier. So I'll... Hello? Yep. Well, there we go, that man, for some reason. I'll switch to you. And then hopefully this guy can actually pick up all of the things. Hello guys over there, how are you doing? Yes, I think you're... Hello over there, how are you doing guys? Are you alright? Well, that's... That's weird, actually. We're, okay, uh, over there is actually where you are. Let's stop messing about now, shall we? Okay, so I, you can just open them. Yeah, this is the bathroom, right? Which now has all of the things that I need. So... I can't really hold more than... Right, Jesus Christ. I can't really hold more than one thing at a time. So how do I... Yeah, I, I just have to do that. Yeah, here we go. Over here. And... Where's my... Oh, oh, I think I was holding the key. Please don't be... Right, yes. I can put the key through here now. Like that. And then let me immediately... No, actually, um... No, let, let, let me do this first. Let me get this. The crowbar doesn't matter too much, so I'll grab you first. And I should be able to do this. Over, over there, actually. Maybe not. Yeah, that's what the holes and stuff are for. Okay, it's over there. I can't do that yet. I need to switch over to... I think it's you. There's definitely a female who is near that section. Maybe you? I think. Like, the character that I played as right at the end of the last episode. Yeah, right here. You're hiding in there. And I've just given myself this key, which I can use for one of these. That one. Nice. There we go. Two left. And that's just the end of the game, or the end of this uh, section, I don't know if the end of the game. I've never been here though. Because like, the last episode I switched to this person for the first time, and I just walked around places. Right, what the hell was the code? 1925? That was for cameras. There's a safe up there, what the hell? Oh god, what? I, I believe it was like 19... I, I can go and check. Actually, not the worst thing in the world to just go and double check the code. I can probably see it from without actually having to go down, unless I need to actually shoot the targets again, which hopefully I don't. It said, it said like targets, and then, where the hell is this? Why am I here? What? No, th is this the correct character? No. No, this isn't the correct character, never mind. Who has the slingshot? 1925, yes. 1925 for cameras, and I think this, if I, right, Jesus, if I, you, I believe, there's this door here, which I think is actually a camera, I thought it was the fire door again, but it's the camera door. This one? Yeah, that, that's a camera, right? It has that camera there. So I, I need to follow this wire, yeah, I, I know that this is a door that needs a code. If I follow this wire the other way, through this way, drop that down here, I know exactly where it is. 100% know exactly where this is, just over here, right? This door right here. He might be there. It's 1925, right here. Okay, how, uh, there's a way that I can... What's that part again? Yeah, that one, well, it doesn't really help that much. One, nine... Two, five. Oh my god, I'm making progress. Yes, it's been 14 years, but I actually am making progress. Oh, hello, right, I'm not doing anything, I'm not here, go away, hello, Jesus Christ, I'm not flipping inside of you anymore, which is good. Oh, I'm in here. Uh, can you go away? Is he coming in here again? So that kid's job, just in, like, that normal room, is his job just to sit there? What, what is this? Did I mold all these? No, it's just that. That's done something now. Are you here? 
I don't know what that's necessarily done. Is there anything in here? Is there a coin in here, maybe? That's just... Oh, I know what that's... That, that's just opened the door, yeah. That's exactly what that's done. I go back through here now, which is definitely not where the neighbour is, thank you. I still haven't really gotten a proper jump scare in this game. Like, it's always been just... He's there, then he sees me, then he... Like, not saying that the game's not scary. But, like, it's not scary if you just see him always on a chair, lets me sneaky, oh, now he's suddenly seen me, and then five seconds later I get jump scared. Now, that's not scary. I hope I do get, like, a good jump scare, because I don't think I've ever had a good jump scare in VR. Like, I played FNAF, FNAF VR Hell Wanted is the first game I ever played on this uh, PlayStation VR. And, like, I just didn't get scared. But the thing I get a bit scared of is, like, heights. Like, right now I'm a bit like, oh, I'm on a roof, oh, I'm sliding! Jesus! Right! Yeah, that's not good. I Was that the sound of me getting another trophy? That's not something that I enjoyed. While I'm here, actually, this guy's one job is to do that. There we go. Now we just ignore this guy and pretend he doesn't exist for another 14 years until he's uh, ah. needed again for another coin. Yeah, 3 out of 13 coins, I don't think I'm doing too horrendously bad. I know where another one is, so I'd have 4 out of 14 if I got all of them that I knew where they were. So what went wrong here? That is... Oh, that's just the other side there. Okay, nice. So I think it's just, yeah, like, it's Hello Neighbor. The point is we need to get into the basement. Then I don't know. Maybe the basement is actually the final section. I think I'm fine here. Yeah, I'm fine here. Where am I going, though? Oh, I, I climb this. I would imagine. Here we go. Oh, my Jesus. Freaking Far Cry now, is it? Oh, right. I'm, I've fallen and I can't get up. I can get up this time. No worries. Can I not be inside of the lamppost now, though? Right. I need to be better at this. Yep, there we go. I just need to grab a bit further. And not hit any of the IRL stuff. I need to turn that way. There we go. Turn this way. As long as I'm just continuously holding the button, I should be fine. Oh, this is quite horrific. I'm holding it, yes. Oh my... What the hell? Can I... Just land. Jesus Christ. Right. Um... What the hell do I do now? Oh wait, oh I've got, yeah I've got a bat. Here we go, yeah. A bat for this week. There we go. I was about to say like, oh no, I need the guy with the bat. But I am, I am the guy with the bat. That is me. This is... Horrifying. What the hell? Right, okay. Oh, that's the ceiling. Thank you. Right. Let's just get this over with, shall we? This is... Oh, this is... This is actually terror... Oh my Jesus Christ, this is horrible. Okay, um... Where the hell am I going? What, what, what am I actually doing here? What's what's the, the goal of this? There? Oh, Jesus. Freaking noodle legs. Oh my God. Okay, maybe if I grab... Nah, actually, that, that hand. I think I can grab this. Oh my god, the stand! Oh! Oh my Jesus, I'm freaking falling. What's the point of this, though? Oh, I do get this. There's a freaking zip line right here. Jesus Christ! Didn't even... Oh, see that? Yep. Oh, this is great! This is lovely, that, yeah! Wee! I love this! Best part of my day right there. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, really enjoyable, that. Right, back on solid ground then, yeah? Let's stay like that for the rest of the game, please. Can I, yeah, I can move this over to here. Straight into freaking business, shall we? No messing about. Grab you over there. And then is this something that I can, yeah, it's something that I can... Pull along. I should be able to just land on here. I'm looking the correct way. Then it's cool that the valves are actually used for parkour. Well, that's cool. You don't need to actually turn the valves; you just use them to do parkour. I turn the camera a bit. This is freaking weird. Like, there's a game called Peaks of Yore, which I actually saw fully released recently. That old, oh. brilliant. I think I need to actually hit that down, maybe. Do I need to hit that down from something? 
There's a wrench up there. Let, let me actually check. I might need to do something before I can fully do that. Okay, this, is, this seems like an actual way to just leave. Can I just leave now? Can I have a chalky bar? I can't eat the chalky bar, really. That's a key, though. That's the wrong button. What's this for? Unlock the boot? I'm putting it there. The freaking lock's there. Jesus Christ. There we go. Oh, a coin! Nice! Boom! Four out of uh, 13. Uh, nothing in there. I think I can probably just do this parkour. And that will give me fuel. Oh, I do need to actually turn these, but I can't turn them myself. That one needs to be... Well, they all need to just be right. But I can't physically turn them. Well, I feel like... Is the magnet something that I need? No, never mind. Right, let me just try and do this part. Oh, I see. I need the wrench up there. So I can... I can just grab this. I can, yes. If I jump. There we go. Perfect. And grab onto this. That's like the things that you see on like Ninja Warrior where they hold onto something just like their freaking fingertips. Here we go. Pull down. And then these all need to be to the right. Size. Oh, I see. It's annoying then, yes? Is one like this where I turn one and they all freaking turn? I'll be here for centuries. I've got two of them on the same bit now. They all need to be like in the same bit, eventually. So, oh, I see. This one only moves. Okay, so if I can get these both like that. What do you mean? You move you two. Um, well, if that's the case, actually, yeah, this is easy. I just get the two ones on the right the same place. Two ones on the right the same place. So I then... No, the mi what is the middle one? All of them. So I want... This I can now move freely. Because that's fine. Like, both of them can be together. But then it's just this one that moves. Why? I'm usually quite good at working these out. Why am I freaking struggling? So the two left and right are now the same. I think that is what I want. Because then I just need to get this middle one to be... Um, no, actually, yeah, yeah. The, the middle one, I can just move... Oh, Jesus. I can just move a bit over random, right? Somewhere random. Somewhere enough to... No, actually, that's not going to work. Jesus, what? Jesus Christ, why am I struggling with this so much? Oh, I've done it. Yes. Then we just switch you over to as soon as you're green. Almost. Oh, it's like so hard to actually turn them. Oh, really? Nah, surely. Yeah, we did it! Jesus! Or, like, is it just gonna be not freaking correct? Okay, so what do I need to do now? Am I still... Jesus, that was that was a freaking workout and half. I did my freaking exercises today, and that was that was harder. Genuinely harder than the freaking push-ups and pull-ups that I forced myself to do earlier. So can I... Well, I can grab onto this, yeah. Okay, it's not gonna, like, fall down. I thought that I had to make it fall down for some reason. But then I tried grabbing onto it, and it didn't really work. So I spin around now, grab onto you, or these monkey bars again. There we go, grab onto, it's so weird like doing this, where I actually like have to physically like move around and it's it's weird. Moving around while playing VR, unheard of, oh it's a bit weird sometimes. I'll just grab it, thank you. Seems like all I need, I'll drop down. Oh, I'll, I'd like to drop down, right, Jesus. And we'll fill up the car, shall we? It's not telling me where. It was maybe there, isn't it? Yep, there we go. It wasn't suggesting me to do that. There we go. That should be everything now. You mean to start the car? 
Thank you. Nice. So, did we just, yeah, we just started the car specifically just so, like, the door would open. No, we didn't start the car to use it, we started the car just so the door would actually bother to open. Well, it's just telling me the wrench is still there for some reason. I probably still need the wrench for something? I'm meant to be... Do I need to climb rope? No? Hello? Oh, hello? How are we doing? Hey, yeah, I kind of forget that. This is your house and you probably know how to get everywhere. I did get another coin though, so this kid can actually do his freaking job for once. There we go. Nice. We now have 4 out of 13. I can get 5 out of 13 probably relatively easily. I don't know, like, I kind of feel like... Who the hell was I playing this? Uh, you was it? The one that had the... No. Was it? No, it, it wasn't it, it wasn't this character. This is the character that allowed me to have the code. It was... I forget who... Oh, the guy, the person with the bat. I think it's you who has the bat. What, do I need the wrench for more, then? Is that why it's doing this? Okay, no, I don't need to do anything with that. Can I open this from the other side, then? No, I just can't open them at all. So what can I actually do here? I can... Yeah, I, I guess I can give the wrench to... Uh, that might be why, like, it's showing... Oh, you probably don't need the wrench anymore, but someone else might. Oh yeah, we need the wrench for over here. There we go. So I can... Do that. Give it to... Sorry? I'm trying to give it to my friend here. Give it to that person over there. Who is... Uh, that is actually you, yeah. The person, yeah. The person to get down there is the person that has the slingshot. So now we actually... My freaking headset. I'm still terrible actually wearing this headset correctly. This person can actually go and grab that. Yeah, I can... I can just fall down, right? Save a bit of time. I'm a speedrunner. Thank you very much. Or like speedrunning this in VR. I might try it. Who knows if I ever get actually good at it. Right, and then, oh Jesus, how long is this going to take then? Well, not, not too long. Trust me, I can use a freaking wrench, or as we call a spanner in real life. It's in a video game. Difficult. I feel like I'm getting somewhere here, though. Down in that basement. I feel like that's the end goal, which is good. But, like, there's also a bunch of other stuff that I can do. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world if I just do that now. Oh, I've already been freaking playing for, or recording for 50 minutes somehow. Like, I just checked a few minutes ago and it said, like, 47 minutes. Somehow. It really does not freaking feel like that. Yeah, I was about to say, why am I playing as this character? And now we have this weird underground thing open. What's that saying on the floor? Oh, that's something that I need? Is it? I probably... Yeah, I'm gonna... Nah, I, I don't need it for here. I can come back up anyway if I need it. Oh, what do you have? You just have a... Yeah, you just have a bat. Well, I'm ready. Oh, I actually am ready. Fair enough. There we go. I very much so need the bat. Nice. I mean, I feel like a decent amount of progress has been made. Like, I kind of just sped up a bit. As, as I... I don't know if I said it at the beginning, but, like, I'm a bit ahead on... Can I... Can I just get through? Just teleport through them. I can't get rid of that last bit. I'm a bit more ahead on actual, um, like, the series now. Don't fall down. Thank you. Put that away for now. I don't know this. Right. Is it here? Probably not here. Let me just fall into the abyss. Right, so that playing as this character. I can do something up here. I probably can't do it for now, yeah. That opens once I have this code. It's just a bunch of codes that I need, apparently. That's a fuse just over there. That's another fire door. So once I get that code, I can open a bunch of things. I think that's just another distraction for him there. I feel like I might be able to open the fridge. Just do that. There we go. Turn behind. There, no. Never mind. I can't... Right, can't open the fridge. That's probably another, like, main thing that I need to open. Hello! Right! I'm hidden! There's also that. Oh, hello! Right, I thought when I was in there I was alright. I'll take the wrench and I take this weird button device here. And then I guess this character really for now is just... Can I just pick both of them up? No, actually I can't because I need to open this door, that's fine. This character is really now just to 
use to give other characters items. Because they have like all the items and then they can just give other characters items down there. Because this person just can't do anything now. Like until we work out how to open these gate doors, this character is pretty much completely useless. I can't, I'm struggling to freaking pick up this. I was just gonna go outside and see what this actual like shooting this thing does. Because it's gotta do something to like this window. It's connected directly to the window. So I don't know what that specifically does. Also, oh wait, oh. Okay, so like the more I shoot, am I not shooting it the correct way then? There's like a platform here that should lower. Oh yes, I wasn't shooting it the correct way. Okay, there we go. I still, how the hell? Oh, there we go. Right, lovely. Been an hour and 20 minutes now, ladies and gentlemen. I said I'd only play for an hour a day. But I feel like I've made, well, I, I mean, I've made a decent amount of progress. I don't really feel like it's enough for an episode yet. I also really want to try and do this myself as well. Like I really don't want to have to look up anything. Well, I guess now I would shoot this again, and then it goes up. No, shoot it that way, right? No, shoot it this way. There we are. That's freaking cool. I need to do it twice more. And I should be all the way up. Okay, can I just... No, I can't turn it forward now. Can I just shoot it once more? Without oh, falling off. Can I actually have... Uh, that way should be... No. I need to actually be relatively near the freaking thing. There we go. Nice. Oh, hello. Hello, guys. The thing is, when I see stuff like this, I'm like, is this actually what I'm meant to do? Or is this just for a freaking coin? Which it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. Uh. I mean, I'm just glad to make some amount of progress for the story or for just the extra thing. Let's shoot this down. I mean, I need to do everything eventually anyway. Oh, it's here! This! Oh, well, I'm, I'm, I'm playing a little party game now. Whoops. Right, I failed. Try that again, shall we? Right, I've just shut the freaking... Oh, brilliant, I've just shut the door. This is... Oh, I see. There's, there's a little freaking hidden one. What are you doing there, mate? Where are you hiding from me? Oh, dear. Let me actually open the door. Bully. Thank you. Can we stand back? I hear I see. Make it nice and easy. Boom. 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 That's not all of them. Of course it isn't. Where the hell... What? Excuse me? But that's not me actually being in the room. I can't... Yeah. Where's another... Where's another freaking target? Is this not like the correct order? Can I go in here though? Oh, I am in the room. Okay, what? Can I target onto freaking here? Where is this? Oh. Right, this is a place where a coin could be. Never mind, maybe? Also, very weird to maneuver on that section. Here we go, we make proper progress. We've actually gone into a new route. Oh, I freaking, of course. Of course. I can't do it from down here, though. Let me see, there might still be other. Yep, there's way more targets. Of course, there is. I feel like this is actually to open the doors. Oh, there's going to be another target here. Oh, God, this is actually going to be difficult. Okay, I guess I went off the episode doing this then. Spending 14 years trying to do this. What is this? Thing? Or is that the thing that it's actually going to do? Yeah, I feel like that might open once I've done this. Alright, let's do this. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four, six targets. There should be. I don't think there's any more. Can I get any of them in any order? Because if I can, like, start just by getting that one out of the way. I can. The other two annoying ones out of the way. There we go. Now oh, it's easy. Look at this. Smash through them ones. Simple. Them four are simple. It's just them two, like, far away. Can I... Shortcut. Shortcut. 
I'm a speedrunner. Let's freaking go. Boom. Straight through the door. Straight over to here. Straight grabbing the key. Let's go. I'm about to get... Oh, hello. Jesus Christ. Is that somewhere... I don't think that's somewhere I can get to anymore down there. I'm pretty sure. So if I just, like, actually play as this character... Well, I, I can just, yeah, just put it down over here. Because there's, there's, there's some places you can put items and they're just soft lock there because, like, you can't get actually to the section. Make sure that actually... Is that falling down? Oh, what's that? What are you doing there for me? Actually fall down. Make sure it actually falls down. There we go. Then switch to the male. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Put it through the hole. The female can open one of the locks on the... Is this one of the locks on the door? Like, I need, like, a purple or a blue whatever colour lock or a key for this other door. Is this a key for the actual... Yeah, I think it's a key for the main door. Well, I don't know the main door. Like, I imagine possibly that place below is, like, where this last key is going to be. And then there's one other key that I can find, which I need for the place to put that fuse in. Which I imagine that fuse actually would be, if I can open these, which I think I can, because I can interact with them, that fuse will be what opens this. Also, is this? Oh, this is, this is working again. Good. That crowbar was stuck on the freaking ceiling for a while. And that was quite horrifying, because I might have needed it. It's not that bad with the crowbar, though, to be fair, because there's more than one crowbar. Also, no, actually, I think what the valve's going to do, or what that thing's going to do, is it's going to open that gate there. But I was in there, which is really annoying, but I obviously, like, didn't know the code. So the last thing, at least I'm going to do today, because I don't want to play much, like, it's genuinely been like an hour and 20 minutes now, and I really need to make sure I don't play for more than an hour and a half, because otherwise I'm, I'm just going to be freaking sick. Like, I don't get motion sick, it's just my head starts hurting. And it's been hurting for a while now, but there's Hello Neighbor to be played. The gameplay comes before my mental well-being, which is definitely the thing that I should be doing. Is this? Yeah, this is for that. A bit annoying, because it means that we don't actually get another new place. But the blue key, does the blue key just unlock this door and the other place? The only thing is now, I don't know what I would actually do next, is the thing. Like, there's places that I can't actually get to. I think I've just missed something somewhere. Like, there's codes, there's loads of codes. There's like a knife and fork code that I need. There's a fire code that I need, which has... Oh, an actual valve in it, I see. Okay. And then, yeah, there's, like, the code for... Well, there, well, there's another, like, fire door somewhere that I need the code for. I also need, like, the blue key, the key for the other place as well. But that, ladies and gentlemen, is going to end episode number three of Hello Neighbor. I also just see random holes again. There was that key that I shot a balloon down and there was a key that dropped. Did I pick up that key? Or did the neighbour pick up that key, and that's the key that magically appeared on the key rack at that time? Maybe that's it. Because he can get to some places that I can't, so he picks up keys and puts them somewhere else, so I can actually grab them. Either way, that, ladies and gentlemen, is going to end episode number three of Hello Neighbour Search and Rescue. As usual, there will be a link in the description to watch every soul. But for now, hopefully you enjoyed. Please if you did subscribe for our brand new, this is the boy, boss, fab one, and shouting, of course, always, peace.